Now, for stargazers out there, last night and tonight will be a busy night in the sky. The annual Perseids meteor shower seems sees 20 times more shooting stars in the sky than normal. Uh, and Leo Enright, space commentator, joins us now. Um, first of all, uh, just explain to people, Leo, we're going to be see shooting stars, but they're some kind of meteors. What, what are meteors? Good morning. Meteors aren't stars, of course. They're, in fact, just tiny specks of dust uh, emitted, generally, generally speaking, by comets, uh, as they're orbiting the sun. Now, these specks of dust actually trail out behind the comet uh, all the way around its orbit. And as the Earth moves around the sun, and actually we move very, very, very fast indeed, uh, uh, we plow into these uh, specks of dust. And as we hit them, or they hit us, um, they produce these flashes in the sky. Okay. And your 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 line is breaking up on us ever so si- slightly, Leo. I don't know if you can. I don't know if there's anything you can do your own end. We're we're working on at this end too. If people want to go and look out tonight at the sky, they don't need a telescope or anything. They can see this with the naked eye. Is there a direction that they should be looking in? Kira, this is uh, this particular meteor shower is called the Perseids, uh, and that's because they they appear to come. We're moving. Uh, at 60 kilometers, sorry, uh, more than that, uh, that we're going to hit these things at 60 kilometers a second, moving towards the constellation Perseus, uh, and that is in the northwestern sky. They will appear to come from the northwest, but you'll see these uh, meteors all across the sky, about 80 hour if you're in a very very dark place okay and is there a a particularly good time leo to go out Uh, you know if somebody wants to get a blanket put it down in the back garden or whatever and lie up lie down look up at the stars is there is there a good time to see these well, uh, Kira, we're lucky this year because uh, the, the moon is only a tiny sliver. Uh, and that's really why people are getting a bit excited. So p- pretty much any time uh, uh, after sunset is, is good for watching the Perseids. It's a beautiful sight. You'll definitely see more meteors than usual uh, shooting stars in the sky above you. Uh, and it's well worth going out and watching. Ah, look, I, I think I might just take you up on that. That sounds like a really nice thing to do this evening. Thank you very much for speaking to us. That is Leo Enright, space commentator. So out after dark tonight, look to the northwest mm. and wish upon a shooting star, Jonathan.